Hello, everyone. This is Thomas Renee, the head of voice and speech at the American Academy of Dramatic Arts. Uh, I want to make this video specifically to go over the 18 cardinal vowels. Um, I just want to either tell you or remind you that the cardinal vowels do not necessarily associate with any one particular language. Uh, it really is a way, uh, a system from the International Phonetic Alphabet through the International Phonetic Association to reference sound and, and uh, speech action of vowels, uh, open channel sounds, how we can place our tongue and use our tongue um, to create uh, very different sounds acoustically. And they, they, they help us by being landmarks for us to discuss uh, and landmarks for us to reference when we're talking about a language, when we're talking about an accent, to compare this sound to that sound. Um, so again, there are 18 cardinal vowels. Um, they have primary vowels, one through eight, and then the secondary vowels are the nine through 16. Cardinal, by definition, means most important. I don't think these vowels are necessarily more important than any other vowel, but again, I think what's important about them is it gives us the language to refer back to. So we can say, oh, my E vowel is like a cardinal one, but it's a little lower and a little bit retracted. So I know how to get there. Um, the point of this video really is I just want to go through them and just kind of give each one and, and give a list of them, okay? So let me just share the 18 cardinal vowels so we can see them as we go through. And uh, yeah, and so I'm just going to go through it. So cardinal one, an unrounded, closed front, E, E. Two, unrounded, close mid front. A, A. Three, unrounded, open mid front. E, E. Number four, unrounded, open front. A, A. Number five, unrounded, open back. A, A. Number six, a rounded mid uh, open mid back all all number seven a rounded close mid back all all number eight a rounded close back ooh ooh moving back to the front Back to the front, uh, to number nine, so it's the lame. Um, number nine, which is that rounded, close front. E, E. Number 10, rounded, close mid front. E, E. Number 11, rounded, open mid front. E, E. Number 12, a rounded, Open front. Uh, uh. Number 13, a rounded open back. Uh, uh. Number 14, back to unrounded. We're still at the back though. So we have an unrounded open mid back vowel. Uh, uh. Number 15, which is an unrounded close mid back. Uh, uh, number 16, an unrounded close back. Uh, uh, 17 is now we're in the center, the middle of the tongue, so the central vowel, 17, which is an unrounded close central vowel. E, E. And number 18, last but not least, we have the rounded close central e e excellent um so yeah just a list of those cardinals um i did the best i can I, I, i'm not sure if there's any i'm sure there is an exact science to it everyone's mouth is a little bit different i'm mostly coming from my own linguistic perspective my own accented perspective um but i try to keep that as pure as possible but i'm sure it's open to debate and open to conversation um and so if you want to talk about it Hit me up, we'll talk about it. Uh, but I hope that helps no matter what. I hope it gives you a little bit of uh, some landmarks for you to work with and for you to practice and uh, to help talk about language and accent work.
All right. Well, thank you guys. Uh, keep practicing as always. Bye.